how to have your most authentic week. Do you live a life that is true to you? This is the easiest way to find out and adjust accordingly. I know that to live a more authentic life, it's important to make choices that align with who you truly are. This task is the best tool to start living authentically right away. Flip open your calendar and look at the things you did last week, both professionally and personally, from the time you get up until you go to bed. Now grab a pen and paper. You are going to categorize all of these activities under the heading of energy giver or energy taker. For example, sports. Maybe you hate sports and you find it a total energy taker. Maybe you love sports and it costs you physical energy, but it gives you a lot of mental energy too. Then it's an energy giver. This is not so much whether it costs you physical energy, like a walk with a dog, but how much energy something gives or costs you mentally and or emotionally. If it drains you or energizes you, Think about that dinner with your in-laws, back-to-back meetings, a party with friends, cleaning your house, late-night emails, drinks with colleagues after work, that Netflix night, the hours you spend sleeping. Does it cost you energy or does it give you energy? Everything you do gets a spot on the list. If you now look at your lists and both of them are fairly balanced, or your energy givers are way more than the takers. You're living an authentic life. You know there are things that need to be done, but you also know how to make yourself and your wants, needs and happiness a priority. So let's be clear. Authentic living doesn't mean you only do things you like to do. It does involve doing things you would rather not. That's the reality of life. We all want 100% energy giving experiences but it's more real to look at the balance of your life. If you look at your list, and the energy takers list is way longer than the energy givers, you have some work to do to live more authentically. Maybe you don't know who you really are, or what you want to spend your time on, or what gives you joy. Or you do know, but you find it hard to really choose yourself and adjust your schedule to who you authentically are. If you want to live your life as authentically as possible, start with an authentic week. Before you commit or add anything to your schedule, ask yourself, when doing this, am I staying true to myself? Yes, go for it. No, make a change. So, what are you going to do this week? Live on autopilot or on authentic pilot? Want to find out more? Dive into all the other authenticity content in this How To Be You Masterclass via the link below.